what's with you all of a sudden? You're being awfully friendly. Aha! Gotcha! You want the mimic creeps, don't you? Well, I guess there's no harm in it. Here you go, buddy. Eat up. <laughs> you got a cute. Oh, maybe I'll tickle you for a bit. Is something bad about to happen? Is everything going to be all right? I'm not too concerned myself. I've lived my life. It's my son I'm thinking of. He lives in a city far away with his wife and wee kiddies. I really hope they're okay. Hold on a sec. Did you just take something? No, I, uh... It belongs to the great Sid now. I'll make good use of it. <laughs> An old ball. I like that. You keep it. Hey, thanks, Gramps. So how is he doing? Poor guy. He must have had it rough. Sure hope he gets better soon. He needs to fight tooth and nail now more than ever. Thank heavens he pulled through. When I saw him carrying him up here, I thought for sure he was a goner. He must have had one powerful guardian angel watching over him. She's started to look a little tired recently. I wonder if she's all right. It must be hard to keep on going when nothing changes. If things carry on like this, she might wind up here alongside him. You don't look too good either. Rest here for a while. That's better. Now you take care of yourself. Oh, it's you. I'm afraid your friend's condition remains unchanged. You'll have to be patient and keep the faith. Just like a fine wine, time is essential. It's no use. He isn't getting any better. What should I do? What if he stays like this for the rest of his life? There. Coming. What was that, Cloud? Oh. Uh. Damn! What the hell's going on? There. There. Coming. <gasps> oh no! What's happening? This is bad! It's a big one! I hate earthquakes. What the heck is this? Is a live stream bursting up from down below? Damn, that's... This is bad! Sid? What's wrong? Uh, nothing. I can't climb back inside. But I... <laughs> Don't you worry. Old Sid won't kick the bucket that easy. Be careful. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. Damn it, it's one of the freak weapons of all the times to show up. Bring it on, you son of a bitch.
get the gear going! <sighs> Just a little more, and we would have beaten it. The live stream settled down now at least. Oh, you gotta be kidding! This is bad. The main current's gonna blow! Something way bigger than the last one's coming! Let's get out of here! But what about Cloud and Tifa? Oh, idiot! This is no time to worry about others! There's no telling when the stream will blow! Whoa! There's no time! Hurry! Tifa! Cloud! Get the hell out of there! This is bad! The tremors are getting worse! Hang on, Cloud! Doctor! Shouldn't we move outside? Yes, it will be safer in an open area. Don't you worry about a thing, Cloud. I'll take you somewhere safe. No! The building can't take it! We have to hurry! We're coming! Ready, Cloud? Let's go! Cloud! 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 No! Where am I? What's happened, What's happened to me? To me? <laughs> Cloud? Cloud? Where's Cloud? Cloud? Huh? huh? What? what? Who? 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 Who is it? Who is it? I, can't I can't hear you! Hear you. <laughs> Wait a minute! I don't know anything about that! You're wrong! It wasn't me! I'd never do anything like that! No! Stop! Stay back! Somebody! Help! Please! Are we inside your dreams? Or is this... your mind? You're searching, aren't you? Searching... for yourself. I'll help you. We'll work together and get the real you back. But... where do we start? That starry night by the water tower. The promise we made. What if it was all just made up? That starry night. Secret wishes. Sealed away. 
all those tender feelings that no one ever knew. The gates of Nibelheim five years ago, Sephiroth and I passed under these gates. And that's how it all started. So this leads to Nibelheim. Yeah, it's probably best that we start there. Let's take a look, Cloud. I know it's not easy, but I'm here with you. Cloud, look! Here's the water tower. And the old guy's in. The only truck in the village. It's been here since we were kids. This is the Nibelheim you remember. It's the same as my Nibelheim. So that makes this our Nibelheim, right? Five years ago, two men from Soldier came here. Sephiroth and a young, cheerful person. Can you tell me again what happened? How does it feel? Five years ago. That's when I saw the real Sephiroth for the first time. It's been a while since you were back time. in your hometown, right? So, how does it feel? I wouldn't know. I don't have a hometown. Um... Then where are your parents? The hero Sephiroth. My mother's name was Genova. The greatest soldier. She died giving birth to me. My father... But to tell you the truth, he came across as rather cold. What am I saying? Now, move out. I remember feeling this strong sense of foreboding about him. No, Cloud. I've been too afraid to say anything. I've been hiding it all along. But I won't this time. You weren't here. Cloud, you didn't come to Nibelheim five years ago. I waited, you know. But you never came. The two soldiers dispatched to Nibelheim were Sephiroth and someone else. Now, move out. You mean the member of Soldier who left for Nibelheim with Sephiroth? Wasn't me? I'm not going to say anymore. You have to find the answer yourself. If you can't, you'll... Take your time, Cloud. Slowly, little by little, okay? You mean the member of Soldier who left for Nibelheim with Sephiroth? Wasn't me? That starry night by the water tower. Don't be impatient, Cloud. You have to stop chasing yourself if you want the answer. Try going back. Piece together all of those little memories. Slowly. Little by little. Like the stars which filled the sky that night.
from the beginning, okay? Try and remember. That's right, I was wearing those clothes. Yeah, and that's right too. You were pretty short back then. And cute. Sephiroth said... that you created your memories by basing them on my stories. The starry night sky. You mentioned that first, I remember. The stars were so beautiful. We talked at the water tower. Just you and I. That's why I kept believing you were the same cloud. And I still do. I believe you're my cloud, from Nibelheim. But you don't believe it. This memory isn't enough. Cloud, what about your other memories? Hmm, no, not memories. A memory is something that is consciously recalled, right? That's why sometimes it can be wrong or become twisted. The memories that lie deep inside your heart are different. They tell the truth. If you were able to recall those memories, then... That's it! What about a memory that's connected with me? Rather than remembering something I said, why don't you say something and I'll see if I remember it? If I can, then the memory must be... Talk to me. About anything. A memory that's important to you. Come to think of it, why did you want to join Soldier in the first place? I seem to remember it was a snap decision. I was, I was devastated. frustrated. I wanted, I wanted to, be, to be, noticed. be noticed. I was sure that if I got stronger, I'd be respected. You wanted to be noticed? By who? Who? You know that already. By you. By you. That's who. Me? Why? Tifa, have you... forgotten what happened back then? You... I'm sorry. I have no idea. No, it's alright. You were having a hard time. You had your hands full. So it's no surprise that you don't remember. What about back then? It's important to me. It may be a bitter memory, but it's still very important. Do you want to see it? Come on, hurry! Secret wishes, sealed away. All those tender feelings that no one ever knew. You know where this window leads, don't you? All right, let's go. My room? It was my first time there. It was? Really? Before that, I'd only ever looked up at it from the outside. Hey! Look! It's Cloud! You think he wants to come in? So, that was the first time you came into my room? Yeah, it was, I remember. 
Even though we lived next door to each other, I never really knew you that well. Funny, I've always thought we were close. Thought we were close since childhood. But I don't remember us hanging out. My memory of you begins at the water tower, under the stars. Always the same trio. That's right. I... thought you were idiots. What?! You would always burst into laughter at the smallest things, like children. But we were children! I know. I was the idiot. I really wanted to play out with everyone, but you never asked me to join you. The more that went on, the more I thought I was different. Different from this bunch of immature kids. But maybe... Just maybe, one of you might call out to me. I held on to that hope, so I kept hanging around nearby. But I was too stubborn and rebellious, and I always felt so awkward around people. I was... weak. The night I asked you to meet me at the water tower, I thought... I thought you'd never show up. That you hated me. Yeah, it was a bit sudden. I was... surprised. But you know... While it's true we weren't that close... After you left the village, I thought about you a lot. I used to wonder how you were doing, if you'd managed to enlist with Soldier. I started reading the newspapers, thinking I might see an article about you. Thanks, Tifa. Tell him what you told me later. He'll be so happy. I will. Huh? Didn't something happen on this day? Something out of the ordinary? This was the day. Your mother, Thea. Oh, the day... the day Mom died. I want to see Mom! I wonder if there's anything beyond that mountain. scary. People have died there. The mountain that no one crosses alive. Well, what about the dead? Did my mom cross the mountain? I'm gonna go see. remember the path I walked. Tifa missed her step. I ran to her, but I didn't make it in time. We both fell off that cliff. Back then, I only scarred my knees, but... Cloud! Why did you bring Tifa to a place like this? 
the matter with you? What if she dies? Tifa was in a coma for seven days. We all thought she wouldn't make it. If only I could have saved her. I was so angry at myself for my weakness. Ever since then, I felt Tifa blamed me. I went out of control. I had to get into fights with anyone. That was the first time I heard about Sephiroth. I thought if I were strong like Sephiroth, then... If I could just get stronger, even Tifa would have to notice me. So that's how it was. I'm so sorry, Cloud. If only I'd remembered more clearly what happened back then, I could have done something sooner. It's not your fault, Tifa. It's mine. But that's... that's when we were eight! Hey, I've got it! You weren't created five years ago. My childhood memories can't possibly be made up. Hang in there, Cloud. Just a little bit longer. We're so close to finding the real you! Let's go back to Nibelheim one more time. The truth is here. The answer is right in front of us. Cloud, wait. Where? Where are you going? The reactor? To the Mako reactor. The Mako reactor. Uh, the five years ago. Isn't you? Z. Z. Ak. You remembered! That's right! It was Zack who came to Nibelheim with Sephiroth. Then, where were you, Cloud? Did you... see this? I... saw it. <laughs> My mom... Who, Tifa? Are you? The village? Give them back! I respected you. Admired you. That's what happened. You were with me. You were watching over me. Yeah, I remember. So, that was you. Hey Cloud, if you aren't feeling well, 
Why don't you lose the helmet? Yeah. Yeah. This is... me. I never made it into soldier. I told everyone I would before I left the village. I felt so ashamed. I didn't want anybody to see me. How does it feel? It's been a while since you were back in your hometown, right? You did come. You did keep your promise. You really did come when I was in a bind. Sorry, I didn't get there sooner. Cloud, it's alright. Did you honestly think the likes of you could? Don't push your luck. Say goodbye now, so we can meet again. Cloud, 
Are you all right? There. Voices. Oh, yeah. We're in the live stream. Everyone's waiting. Let's go back, Cloud. Back to everyone. Yeah. We'll go back together. Hey, you all right? Tifa! Uh, uh... Barrett, I came back. What about Cloud? Is he all right? Yeah, don't worry about him. He's tough, that one. Barrett, I... I found the real Cloud when I was in the live stream. Well, it wasn't me that found him. Cloud, he did it all on his own. Yeah, I shouldn't have doubted him. He gave in to you, though. You're one hell of a woman. I guess people have so many things pent up inside. So many things that are forgotten. Strange, isn't it? Yo, Tifa! Snap out of it! Tifa! I'm sorry, everyone. I don't know what else to say. It's okay, Cloud. All you've been doing lately is apologizing. I never was in Soldier. The events from five years ago? All that stuff about Soldier? It was just an illusion that I created. By the time I left my village, I boasted to everyone about becoming a hero. But in the end, I wasn't good enough to make it. I was so ashamed and weak. Then I heard my best friend Zack talking about himself. I mixed his life with my own and created a fantasy. I've been trapped in it until now. An illusion? Sure had me fooled. Physically, I'm very similar to a soldier. Hojo's Sephiroth copies are nothing special. The process that was used to create them is almost identical to the ones that were used to create soldiers. The only difference was that the subjects involved were weak-willed. You see, those who are a good prospect for soldier aren't just bathed in Mako. Their bodies are actually injected with Genova cells. For better or worse, only the strong-willed are chosen. It has nothing to do with Genova's reunion, either. It's just that if the process is used on someone who's weak-willed, like me, they lose themselves. A man born from Genova's cells, Sephiroth's will, and his own weaknesses. That's the cloud that you all knew. I was merely an inhabitant of my own illusionary world. But I don't need illusions anymore. It's time to stop living a lie and start being myself. You mean the little stubborn, rebellious cloud, right? <laughs> Some change that is. Cloud, what are your plans? I hope you're not thinking of leaving. I'm the reason Meteor is hurtling towards us. If there's anything I could do to change that, I'll do it. Yeah. So you're gonna carry on fighting for the planet? Hmm, <laughs> lapdog? Hmm. <laughs> Though I might need to be put on a tight leash. <laughs> Cause it's your skinny ass and he's watching. What? I don't get it. There ain't, ain't no, no getting get off of this train we're on. Cloud? I 
was deeply moved by your story. I'm kind of weak myself, so I know how you feel. No one knows when the fighting will begin, so let's get ready. Listen here, Clank. We're in the middle of a huge materia mission. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, I didn't want to rush you or nothing, but there's still the undersea Marco reactor in June on. As far as I know, that's the only one left. How about we head out there? Cloud, let's do our best, okay? Come on, Cloud. This ain't no time to mess around. Move it. Go. To Judah. Ah! Uh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. So sorry, I, I'm performing a very delicate maneuver. Sorry if that was a wee bit sudden, but we need to get to June on fast. My motion sickness is a real killer. Although, for some reason it didn't affect me when I believed I was in Soldier. Oh. Hey, then maybe you know something that can help. Well, according to my research, you get all tense, you won't get sick. But it's not like you can pick and choose when that happens. In a vehicle with this much space, moving about is a good idea. It might also help to do some exercises. In the army, I spent a lot of time in trucks. That sucked. Oh, and there's one thing you should never ever do. And that is... Read! Anyway, once you're sick, there's nothing you can really do about it. I know it's tough. Yeah, well... At least having friends close by keeps my spirits up a little. Even though I still feel... Ugh. Where's the next stop? Can we just get there already? I know! Put me in the party! So I can get off the ship. It's good to have you back with us. To escape from a fantasy world. Huh. Which world is preferable, I wonder? Now that I've been one, I know how tough it is playing lead. Like who has what material. I end up forgetting that stuff instantly. Dude. Do you want do you want to leave? Should I play on it? Why not? Now how did it go? I've heard that melody somewhere before. I played it quite well. I have the sheet music for that. Huh? What's this? There's something here in between the sheets. Tifa, what has happened to our village? Was it all an illusion or just a dream? No, it was neither. I remember clearly. I tried to save those still free of the flames, but I couldn't muster the strength. Burning with rage, I headed to the Marco reactor to kill Sephiroth. He was nowhere to be found, 
In his place I found you, Tifa, collapsed inside. I felt saving you was far more important than going after Sephiroth. Inside the reactor there were others still breathing, but I was only able to save you. As I was coming out of the reactor, Shinra troops were just arriving. I recall that the one giving orders was a scientist named Hojo. He ordered the soldiers to round up all those who had survived for the experiments. I have no idea what kind of experiments he had in mind, but I wasn't about to hand over my dearest student. I carried you on my shoulders, down the mountain and out of the village. Along the way I used the cure spell on you many times. I then departed from Midgar to find you a doctor who could treat you. I don't like that city at all, but my magic wasn't helping. I left you in Midgar with a doctor I could trust, and set off again on my travels. I was worried about you, but I'm not the kind of person who stays in one place for too long. Have you fully recovered? Are you feeling better? How many years have passed since then, I wonder? I've returned to the village, but what I see here shocks me. The whole place is back to normal. Except for some odd-looking people in black cloaks loitering around. The village reeks of Shinra, but I don't intend to go after them. You may think that I'm running away, but the truth is... I'm tired of being caught up in their silly little affairs. Well, Tifa, I will have to leave now before whoever lives here gets back. I don't have much time. I feel sure that you'll find this letter, and with that certainty, I have hidden a gift here for you. I think it would come in handy. Although I would very much like to give it to you in person, Having one of my students see me all frail and weak is too much to bear. I can't even jump anymore. I pray that you will continue to refine the techniques I have taught you. Take care, my most beloved student, Zangen. Here you go. Food. Hey! Put this on. It smells a little, but it'll have to do. Hey, you look pretty good in it. Right. Hey! Old man! We at Mikar yet? Shut up! You're lucky I even gave you a ride! What are you going to do once we get to Midgar? I've got an idea. I can pull a few favors. 
Oh wait, those girls still live with their parents. Ah, uh, guess that's out. Yep, change of plan. Hmm, no matter what I do, I'll be needing some money first. Maybe I should start a business. Hey Cloud, think there's anything I'd be good at? Hey old man, what do you think? What are you yapping about? You're still young, ain't you? You youngin' should try everything. You gotta confront challenges at your age. Go out and find your own path. Try everything? Is that all you got? Ah, that's right. I'm a lot smarter and more skilled than any other guys. All right, that settles it. I will try everything. I'm gonna be a jack of all trades. Yeah. Hey, did you hear uh, a thanks, word Bob. I said? Yeah, a jack of all trades. Boring stuff, dangerous stuff. As long as I get paid, I'll do it. I'm gonna be rich. So, Cloud, what about you? No, uh, wait, I, you uh, got it all wrong. It's just kidding. I wouldn't leave you hanging like that. We're friends, right? Jacks of all trades, Cloud. That's what we'll be. Understand, Cloud? Hey, uh, what about this one? Forget it! Just leave him! You're my living legacy.